Cambridge English Preliminary English Test Listening Sample Test There are four parts to the test. You will hear each part twice. We will now stop for a moment. Please ask any questions now because you must not speak during the test. Now look at the instructions for part one. For each question, choose the correct answer. Look at question one. One. What did the girl buy on her shopping trip? Hi, Lucy. Have you been shopping? Yeah, getting stuff for my room at college. What's it like? Well, not large. There's a bed, a desk, but nowhere to put books. And there's only one big light in the ceiling. I'd prefer to have a lamp on my desk, so that's what I got today. If I've got enough money, I'll get some bookshelves next week. They had some lovely big cushions on special offer in the department store. I nearly got one today, actually. So maybe the bookshelves can wait. Now listen again. Hi, Lucy. Have you been shopping? Yeah, getting stuff for my room at college. What's it like? Well, not large. There's a bed, a desk, but nowhere to put books. And there's only one big light in the ceiling. I'd prefer to have a lamp on my desk, so that's what I got today. If I've got enough money, I'll get some bookshelves next week. They had some lovely big cushions on special offer in the department store. I nearly got one today, actually. So maybe the bookshelves can wait. Two. Why did the plane leave late? Good morning. This is your captain speaking. I'd just like to apologise for the late departure of the flight. As you know, we had to wait for the runway to be cleared of snow before we could take off and get on our way. We'll arrive in Manchester in about an hour, and we're told the weather on the ground isn't good. There's heavy rain in the city, and we're expecting strong winds at the airport as we land. But we shouldn't be too far behind schedule. Thanks for your attention. Now listen again. Good morning, this is your captain speaking. I'd just like to apologise for the late departure of the flight. As you know, we had to wait for the runway to be cleared of snow before we could take off and get on our way. We'll arrive in Manchester in about an hour, and we're told the weather on the ground isn't good. There's heavy rain in the city, and we're expecting strong winds at the airport as we land. But we shouldn't be too far behind schedule. Thanks for your attention. Three. What activity does the woman want to book for the weekend? Hello. I'm just ringing to book an activity at your leisure centre for the weekend. I was hoping to book a sailing lesson, but I understand from your website they're all full, so I'm wondering if there are any cycles available to hire instead. There's no information about those. I'd really like to join one of the group rides through the forest. I think I'd enjoy that more than the car racing I tried last time. Could you ring me back to confirm? Many thanks. Now listen again. Hello. I'm just ringing to book an activity at your leisure centre for the weekend. I was hoping to book a sailing lesson, but I understand from your website they're all full. So I'm wondering if there are any cycles available to hire instead. There's no information about those. I'd really like to join one of the group rides through the forest. I think I'd enjoy that more than the car racing I tried last time. Could you ring me back to confirm? Many thanks. Four. Which cake will the girl order? Have you chosen a cake yet? I'm not sure. I guess you're having the lemon one. How did you know? Because you always do. I suppose I do. So, what about you? Hmm. I might try the one with the strawberries on. You had that last time and you weren't keen on it, remember? 
I'd go for the chocolate cake if I were you. Mmm, the chocolate one does look good. Might be a bit sweet though. Oh, I think I'll have the same as you. Now listen again. Have you chosen a cake yet? I'm not sure. I guess you're having the lemon one. How did you know? Because you always do. I suppose I do. So, what about you? Hmm. I might try the one with the strawberries on. You had that last time and you weren't keen on it, remember? I'd go for the chocolate cake if I were you. Hmm. The chocolate one does look good. Might be a bit sweet, though. Oh, I think I'll have the same as you. Five. How much must customers spend to get a free gift? Stacey's Supermarket has some wonderful offers for you today. Buy six bottles of Stacey's own fruit juice in any of our great tasting natural flavours, and the price will be only nine ninety nine. That's a huge saving. And we have a mystery present for all shoppers. To get yours, buy goods today with a total of at least nineteen ninety nine, and we will reward you. And take a look at our special party food. Buy everything for a birthday meal for six, including a cake, for as little as twenty nine ninety nine. Now listen again. Stacey's Supermarket has some wonderful offers for you today. Buy six bottles of Stacey's own fruit juice in any of our great tasting natural flavours, and the price will be only nine ninety nine. That's a huge saving, and we have a mystery present for all shoppers. To get yours, buy goods today with a total of at least nineteen ninety nine, and we will reward you. And take a look at our special party food. Buy everything for a birthday meal for six, including a cake, for as little as twenty nine ninety nine. Six. What did the family do on Sunday? Did you have a good day out on Sunday with the children? Yes, we'd planned to go and see the big fish at the Sea Life Centre, which opened recently, and then go and see a film. We got to the Sea Life Centre, and it was so full we were told to come back an hour later. We did, and it was worth the wait. Much more fun for the children than the art gallery we saw some weeks ago. Couldn't get to the cinema though, but we had a good day. Now listen again. Did you have a good day out on Sunday with the children? Yes, we'd planned to go and see the big fish at the Sea Life Centre, which opened recently, and then go and see a film. We got to the Sea Life Centre, and it was so full we were told to come back an hour later. We did, and it was worth the wait. Much more fun for the children than the art gallery we saw some weeks ago. Couldn't get to the cinema though, but we had a good day. Seven. Which program is on first? Good evening. It's eight o'clock and time for tonight's news. There's something for all tastes coming up later on. If you're staying up late tonight, then you can catch a repeat of last Saturday's Come Dancing program. If you don't have the energy for that, then stay on this channel for Quiz Challenge with teams from Manchester and Oxford competing in the final. Before that, however, you can watch Lucas Wilson preparing some traditional Polish dishes. But now, here's the eight o'clock news. Now listen again. Good evening. It's eight o'clock and time for tonight's news. There's something for all tastes coming up later on. If you're staying up late tonight, then you can catch a repeat of last Saturday's Come Dancing program. If you don't have the energy for that, then stay on this channel for Quiz Challenge with teams from Manchester and Oxford competing in the final. Before that, however, you can watch Lucas Wilson preparing some traditional Polish dishes. But now, here's the eight o'clock news. That is the end.